What's good guys and welcome back into another crypto video. I'm your host today, Jacob Crypto Bro. We're gonna check out Phantom today. Our friend Phantom, it's been such a long time, but you know, now nobody's talking about it. I thought really it's actually, it makes sense to make a good time to talk about it. So we're gonna jump right in to the Phantom price analysis today, as well as a bit of juicy crypto news. And I've also got some exciting news I wish to announce. So stick around to the end of the video. So to our time frame right now, we're gonna hop over to the one hour time frame for Phantom. We're actually in a beautiful, juicy ascending triangle. You can see the increase of the support with the horizontal resistance right here. So if we break out of this particular ascending triangle, um, you know, the technical target is actually around $0.93. But I do think the first area of resistance is going to be the $0.88 because of the particular resistance that we had at this level before from 27th of February over here. So just looking historically, we can see this range actually between the 0 0.87 and $0.94 is quite a sticky point for Phantom. That's a very, very big area of resistance. So I'm very keen to see what could potentially happen for Phantom if it can break to the upside of this wonderful looking ascending triangle. Of course, on the, uh, the bearish scenario, we can still lose the support and probably come down to around the 0 0.74 level, maybe even to the 0 0.72 and maybe even to lower levels such as 0 0.64. But I do not think that would be the case in this situation. I think if we do get the flip that we're looking for after this extreme fear, I think we're likely to at least retest 0 0.76 and then maybe get the pump to the upside, retest 0 0.79 and maybe see a 0 0.088. So I am very, very bullish on Phantom. I still think it's a great, great project. And you know, when we look retrospectively at the previous all-time high, when we take our Fib retracement from this swing high, we can see we've corrected just below the 0.786. And what's really important is actually that's a big, big area of resistance on the Fibonacci side of things too, 0 0.67. So it makes sense that that should be the area of resistance we're looking for. For bull markets of the future, you know, where can we potentially go? Assuming this is the market cycle bottom, we can look at $4.20, we can look at $4.67 and even $5.25 for future prices. I think this is all very realistic pricing. When we look at what happened before from the swing high over here to the swing low, we came up to the 4.236 perfectly. Now, I don't think that will happen again because we do see diminished returns per cycle. So, you know, if we've got the 4.26 this time, you're looking at $12, very, very, very unlikely, um, so to say the least. However, the next cycle, you, you're looking at your 1.618 Fibonacci extensions, and that could very, very much happen. We also just want to say, guys, make sure you head over to my Twitter profile. You can find it down in the description below or in the comments. $100 giveaway right here. It's really easy to enter. Make sure you do enter. If you want to join the Discord as well, you're going to get two times entries, so make sure you do that as well. Come say hello in the Discord channel. Lots of people in here like around 200 people or so so make sure you get yourself in discord and don't miss out on that so yeah this is what's happening with phantom at the moment we've got this lovely ascending channel uh and i think we really need to get back to the one dollar 15 level once we do get to that sort of one dollar 15 sort of in this range where we've got the rectangle between one dollar five and then one dollar 20 we can start feeling very bullish again but i do think this particular price level you know looking at this price analysis and the, the price action it does look like we're ready to break to the upside here for phantom so yeah i'm i'm feeling very hopeful if you want to buy phantom today make sure you use my link at the top of the description and yeah is it a good investment for the future well two billion dollar market cap we could easily make a five or 10x in the future 272 million trade volume so still a lot of traders and people looking at this particular project which is important 2021 offered us three green quarters so far we've had two red quarters so yes we could see a green quarter coming up may is green um you know the start of the year has been very trashy because there was a lot of exploits and things going on with phantom but i think we're heading in the right direction we are heading in the right direction and Phantom has a lot to, to, to offer us, basically. Still got a huge following of 431k. They're still getting a lot of engagements with their tweets. 10, 000, uh, 10 million FTM volume traded on the NFT marketplace. Nice to see that. And uh, yeah, overall, extremely bullish. So a bit of news for today. Global private bank LGT opens Bitcoin and Ether trading. LGT Bank has partnered with the Swiss crypto bank Sabre to offer custody and trading services for Bitcoin and Ethereum. LGT Group, a top family own private banking and asset management group is moving into cryptocurrency by launching bitcoin and ether investments at lgg bank Liechtenstein. so extremely bullish showing more adoption for crypto as we see the demand for crypto has also increased among our clients in recent years so they're just basically providing a solution and offering that 
as part of their own services. So that's really, really good to see. Bitcoin price gains 4% pre-fed as MicroStrategy vows to protect Bitcoin from 21k crash. Warriors over capitulation see MicroStrategy give away key insights into what it should do to Bitcoin strength. So yeah, kind of good. Bulls pin hopes on history data from Cointelegraph Markets Pro. Basically, we can see there's lots of resistance and support at 37.6. A subsequent bounce back saw the pair clip 39,000 at the time of writing, providing a relief to low time frame traders at 4.1% off the lows. So it's interesting to see um, what could actually happen here. Bitcoin is now testing a multi-week resistance, popular trader and analyst rec capital. Meanwhile, concluded about the daily chart following the uptick above 39,000. Break this and the multi-week downtrend is over and Bitcoin will enjoy upside. So it could happen. It, it really could happen. Nobody knows what's going to happen. MicroStrategy plans for Bitcoin to never get to $21,000. So just that alone should tell you enough. And I personally think it's not going to happen anyway. You look at the Fibonacci retracement, 0.786s, it's not coming down to $21,000, guys maybe 24, maybe 26 or 28 at the least. So what else is going on in the market? We can see finally got a green bubble for Bitcoin on the weekly market cap. That's good news. We're sitting at $39,000. Ethereum sitting at 2.85K dollars. And some other coins are really doing well. I mean, Hex is just flying recently, $33.22 billion. I have no idea what's been going on with Hex. It's just got itself to rank six like silently that's absolutely crazy and also fear and greed index sitting at 21 so lots of fear in the market at the moment guys so yeah, before i sign out this video make sure you do go to my twitter make sure you enter this competition if you want more chances to win you can become a patron these will happen every month the giveaways should they be effective six times entries here four time entry over here two times entry over here and you're also getting all these exclusive benefits if you want to enhance your crypto journey as well if you need a bit of a handhold in the market i'm here to support your journey help you make profits capitalize of course not financial advice you should always do your own research and i'm very very happy that you guys have been watching my videos so make sure you smash like smash subscribe Leave a comment down below and see you in another video soon. Bye now.